Team Create is an awesome feature in Roblox Studio that lets multiple people work on the same project at the same time. In this CodaKid Quick Tips video, I'm going to show you how to set up Team Create so you can make games with your friends or strangers or your dog. I don't know, it's not my business. The first step is to turn Team Create on. Make sure your project is saved, then click on View and Team Create to open the Team Create window. Now here's the tricky part. You have to click on the big blue button that says Turn On. This can be tricky to do, so don't feel bad if it takes you a few tries. After a short delay, okay, it's actually more like a medium delay, it should finish loading and almost nothing should change. Team Create is now on, but you're still working by yourself. I know that feeling. To invite other people to work on your project, go to Home, then game settings, and finally permissions. And then type in the username of whoever you want to invite. Just be careful who you invite, because if I get in there, I'm gonna put frogs everywhere. I'm not proud of it, it's just who I am. Anybody who is invited to the project can join by going to the homepage of Roblox Studio and clicking on My Games, then Shared With Me. Just know that anyone who has access to the project can continue editing it even if you close Roblox Studio and shut your computer down. You can't kill it, it lives on the internet now. Okay, that's not true. If you ever do want to turn off Team Create, just click on the three dots in the Team Create window and select Disable Team Create. Well, that's it for this video because I am out of time. If you want more quick tips, make sure you subscribe to the channel and hit the bell. And if you want longer tutorials like how to make your own speed simulator, check out the link in the description below. Oh, I've got to run, I'm late for class. I've already been absent four times this semester and the principal says if I miss even one more class, I can't be a teacher anymore.